Go on, get out of here. It's a little small, but at least it's better than the cage. Doesn't look like he has an owner. Maybe it's the universe saying that we get another dog. Ah, grab him. Oh, another dog. Ah, ah home sweet home. Watch where you're going, kid. Where's the respect, huh? Morning, Baron. Hmm. Good morning, Mom. Morning, Michelle. It's a beautiful day, and I love my new home. I'll see you soon, boy. Okay, okay. If you want to come out and play, I'll be right out here. Or, or maybe by the back door. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're so funny. You're the best, Michelle. Breakfast! Coming. Yeah, it's, it's my ball. I, I shared it with yeah, you. Yeah, you got kibble between your ears. No, I don't. I told you before. You can't be running around like that. If you want to play catch, we play catch. You don't go running in circles around the yard. I wasn't running in circles around the yard. Oh, come on, Sonny. It's my ball. I want to play catch. Oh, hi, Michelle. 
Why are you two arguing about We're not arguing. You guys are brothers. You shouldn't still be arguing over a bone. What's up, Michelle? Yeah, but Sonny took my ball. It's my ball. We were playing catch, and then Sonny took it away from me. Ooh, food. Hey, Sonny, come on over here. Get in some of this yeah, food. Yeah. Aw, thank you. Aw, oh, what about us? Aw, oh, come on. I'm hungry, too. Well, I'm sorry. Please, come on. Look, do you always have to be such a melon head? I'm not a melon head. Hey, that's enough. Enough. But it's my favorite ball. I'm not telling you again. And now, a breaking world animal news report. This just in. Pets around town have mysteriously gone missing. The numbers staggering. The reason, unknown. I know I'll be locking up my pooch tonight, and I suggest everyone else does the same. This has been a breaking news report from MJ Roth. Back to you, Tom. Can you believe that, Mutt? I'll check the house. Hey, Sonny, here comes that guy. Not again. Huh? What? You don't listen. Boss said he's not to be touched. I want no part of this. I'm out of here. Who is that guy, Sonny? Come on, Mutt. Coming. Hurry up. Are we playing a game? <laughs> yeah, you'd better run. Gotta hand it to him. That kid can run. Na 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 na. I can't believe he's my brother. What a melon head. I'll smell some human strays. Check it out. No worries, Mutton. Make sure they get the hint. I don't like to be disturbed, especially during my nap time. Oh, those humans make me nervous. Make them go away. <laughs> it's still mine. You know, come back. Are they gone, Bone? Oh, I hope they don't come back. Hey, yeah, Bone. I smell that dog catcher guy again. That's him, all right. I can smell him. That net keeps getting bigger. Uh, where is he? I don't see nothing. Better move on, copper, or I'll do to you what I did to that mailman. I'm too fragile for doggy jail. Okay, be ready for him. What are we going to do, Bone? He's getting closer and closer. I can smell him. Shh. Chill out, man. Be very quiet. He gonna go away. You know we're not allowed in the pool. Yeah, okay. Too much hair and all. But woohoo! Is this fun? Stop messing around, Bruce. Okay, okay. Hold the ball. I'll grab it in my mouth. All right. I'm biting it. Gats, this isn't dinner. Hold the ball. Don't eat it. Okay. Let me try again. 
I, I think I got it. It's getting away. What are you guys doing? You're not supposed to be in the pool. You'll get us all in trouble. Yeah, we know the hair and all. But the ball fell in. Bruce threw it in the pool. I did not. Quit making up stories, guts. Anyway, I'll have this ball out in the jiffy. Whew. All this work has made me so hungry. I could eat this ball. Jeesh. If this ball were food, we'd have had it out ages ago. Hello? Hello? What's up? <sighs> okay, I don't think you're gonna like this, but unless I get a big lunch of cash, falls into my lap, I'm gonna have to close doggy daycare. How is that even possible? Mom and Dad handled it, AC. Yeah, yeah, they handled easy, but you know, Mom and Dad also gave all their money to charity, and God bless their souls, but this place isn't cheap. There's rich people all over the world. I'm sure they'll be able to help human's best friend. What about all those stars who used to bring their dogs here back in the day? That's a good idea. Let me look through the client's list and see what I can do. I just have to find it. Settle down! The weekly meeting of doggy daycare has come to order. Hey, Bruce, I know I'm new here, but where's Sonny? Don't worry about Sonny, new guy. Shouldn't he be here? I mean, won't he get upset? He left me in charge, all right? In charge of what, exactly? In charge of you lot, missy. Don't you take that tone with me, mister. I won't stand for it. Sorry, Hef, but Sonny left me in charge. Well, Mr. Big Britches, I don't have to sit here and listen to this. Don't make me chase you all around the daycare, Hef. The only thing he's chasing is his tail, man. <laughs> what? I never chase my tail. Only because he can't catch it. <laughs> Junk, that's just not fair. Sonny really did leave me in charge. You know, I think I see your brother Sonny coming this way. What? Haha, <laughs> fooled you. Very funny, haha. <laughs> Look, I'm supposed to be introducing the new guy here. <laughs> Cute little morsel. A morsel of chicken, a morsel of beef, a morsel of ham, a morsel of bacon. Oh, squirrel. God, would you pay attention? Jeesh, you're killing me. What's your name, cutie? Uh, the name's Mutt. Hi there, everybody. Yeah, so this is Mutt, everybody. He's part of our family now, so make him feel right at home. Oh, sweetie, nice to meet you, but I've got a massage appointment. Toodaloo. Wait for me, Michelle. Do you have treats? are in here. I know it's in here somewhere. Oh boy, yummy treats. I wonder what kind. Biscuits, bones, Hot chews, snacks. Scooby snacks. What's that? All this thinking of food is making me sleepy. <sighs> and hungry. Think I'll take a nap. What's she doing in our pool? Hey, lady, what's the big idea? Ha <laughs> ha, you tell her, Sonny. Bruce, grab the net. Yeah, okay. Good work, Bruce. <laughs> ha ha, That's right, lady, our pool. Hey, guys, you better get out of there, or we're gonna get in trouble again. Hey, I smell treats, yo. I got a nose like a bloodhound. Who's in? Chunk says he can smell treats. We should go check it out. Never mind that. I see something much bigger than a treat. Really? Where is it? Over there? Follow me, kid. 
Hello? Amelia, it's Dr. Levy. We have an emergency. I need your help. Get that dog from the dumpster. I am not from the dumpster, sir. Better get out of here, loser, or we're gonna soak you. Hope you brought your bathing suit. Why are you making fun of me and my dog? Stop! Stop! I'm all wet. What are you guys doing? Nothing. Nothing. They're just mean bullies, Amelia. Are you being bullies? No. no. That's what it looks like. Are you guys okay? They got me all wet. You love it at Wags and Whiskers. It sounds like a great place. Hi, Dr. Levy. Ooh, cold hands. You're doing well, Meals. Your parents would be proud. All this work you're doing to help. E even the whole missing pet thing. It just amazes me. Maybe. I don't know if Michelle will ever truly forgive me, though. You, you know she loves you. She shares your spirit. Hey, love, what's up? No school today? Are you sure? Okay, I'll swing by on the way to doggy daycare and pick the two of you up. Love you too, honey. Ruby? She's having a harder day today. Not conducive for being at school. Well, it's time to take him out. You know he's a street dog. He has to be set free. <laughs> I hear you. Thanks, Dr. Levy. Anytime. Bye, Dr. Levy. Well, boys, smells to me like company's coming. <sighs> yeah, man, me smell that too. Me be thinking that much be coming, man. I smell it too, Bone. It's Mutt, all right. I know his scent. So, you want to join the Bone Gang? Sounds like fun. What do I have to do? Time for the initiation. I... I don't trust him, Bone. Oh, man, me not trust him neither, boss. Me think he got the shifty eyes. Yeah, look at him. He's a cute little fella. He smells like a rat to me. Enough. It's decided. What's the initiation? It's real simple, Mutt. All you gotta do is chase the mailman. Just like Bone did way back when he started the gang. It's the only way to know for sure. Ah, uh, I don't understand. The only way to know what for sure, Granite? The only way to know if you're loyal to the gang. Now, go chase the mailman. Okay, I think I can do that. Jackpot! Yeah, the mailman. I'll be right behind you. Over here, fellas. Uh, coming, Bone. What's the plan? Tomorrow, when the mailman shows, you chase him. Got it? Got it, I think. What's that? Help me, help me, I've been stolen. Basically, if things don't change for the better soon, then we're going to lose the place. But what if you guys sell this place and move into a smaller one? The problem is that the bank basically owns most of it. Um, we could probably afford to get a small unit, but it's probably not going to be big enough for the dogs. I don't have much money left after Ruby's medical bills, but I could take on some of your dogs if worse comes to worse. Same here. Like I, I, I can take some of them, anything to do to help out. I mean, they're such beautiful creatures. Honestly, I don't know what I would do without you. And Michelle's really upset because our parents are in here. And thanks. I have to save the place. I can't even imagine what he's doing to these poor creatures. 
I found that dog napper. I bought him right on the butt, yo. He's a very, very bad man. I wonder what's for dinner. We find him and we make him talk. I think I saw the kidnapper. I bet I could follow his tracks right to his hideout. Then what are we waiting for? His name is Bone, and, and they seem like really nice dogs, and they invited me to join their gang. All I have to do is chase the mailman. Nine, nine, nine. These are bad dogs, but I would not trust them. But they're great dogs. You just don't know. Don't do it. You want to stay at doggy daycare. You'll be nothing but trouble, trouble, trouble. You do not understand the situation. They are just using you. I'm out of here. That's it. I'm finished. I'm not going to be any part of this. But they look out for one another. France is right. There is no good that can come of this association. Oh, wait, you don't know what you're talking about, Strobel. I'll see the same, mein Herr. Fine. I'm going to go join them anyway. What's your decision, Mutt? I'll do it. I'll chase the mailman and join the gang. Then let's go get him. Time's a wasting. Okay, coming. There he is. Now wait till he gets a little closer. Oh, I don't know. You ready? This doesn't seem right. Move, go. I don't think I can do this, Bone. What? No, I'm gonna go. What? Where are you going? Get back here. This is all up to me. Yeah, let's go, postman. I'll never forgive you for this. Nobody will ever trust you again, Mutt. Hey, that looks like Mutt. How are you doing, Mutt? Have you seen Sonny? What's going on? I've made a terrible mistake. Have you seen Sonny? Inside. Well, what did you do? Bite somebody? Oh. What? No. Hey, Sonny. Mutt needs to see you. I think he bit somebody. I didn't bite anyone. I know what you've done, kid. It's okay. Follow me. I'll take care of it. Do you know Bone, Sonny? Yeah. Bones and I go way back. Hello, Sonny. Kind of expected to see you here. Didn't think you'd bring this traitor with you. I'm not a traitor. Did he tell you he skipped out on his initiation? Yeah, like a little puppy. Like a cute little puppy. <laughs> but it's just not right to chase after people and try to hurt them. Oh, that makes me so mad. What about us dogs? Bones looks after us. People abandoned us. Yeah, like there's good people or there's bad people. You know, well, what's that, squirrel? We gotta all stick together, people and humans. That way we can help one another. I'd rather trust my own kind, thank you very much, you big puppy, you. Instead of calling each other names, we should work together to help stop that dog kidnapper. Bone, do not trust the little one. He has no honor. He'll run away. Who hasn't made a few mistakes in their life, eh, Bones? But Mud and Bruce are right. We gotta work together if we're gonna stop this dog napper. Join with us, Sonny. It'll be just like the old days. If you won't help catch this dog napper, then I'll just have to do it all on my own. Run, Mutt. That's what you do best. Come on, Brucey. We gotta keep an eye on Mutt. Hey, I'm right here, fellas. You ran right over top of me. Jeesh! You did good today, Bruce. Really? I was, uh, proud of you. Oh, gee, Sonny, thanks so much. Y you know, I was thinking... Shut it, Fleabag. Okay. Hey, guys, wait for me.
Hey, pal, back off. Oh, what do we do, Sonny? You better back down, buddy. Hey, hey, I don't come any closer. I don't like the look of this guy. What do we do? I'll bite ya. I'll bite ya. Get him, Sonny, get him. You better back down, buddy. Well, I'll get around this side. Hey, you don't want to mess with me. You don't want to mess with me. Hey, that's the kidnapper. Sonny, this is the kidnapper. This is the guy. He's getting away. Follow me. I think I know where he's going. Come on, Mutt. Let's follow Sonny. Regular Sherlock Holmes. So, Mutt, what's the plan? What do we do? I'm going to tap into my inner ninja. Oh, brother. What? We wait for him to come out, then we jump him. Okay. We'll back your play, Mutt. Stealthy ninja <laughs> jump. This is what happens when your parents don't think you're responsible enough to have a dog. This is what happens... <laughs> when you ask for a dog for Christmas, but they give you a can of paint instead. Well, I'd say I have a dog now. <laughs> Winning. You guys again. <laughs> Talk about making Sonny, distract easy. him. Bruce, get Come behind on. him. Now, get him, boy! Get him, Mutt. Ha -ha. I got him! I got him! Hang on, Mutt! Atta boy, Mutt! Use the ninja technique! I can't hold him much longer! Hang on, buddy! Brucey, come on! <laughs> Sorry, fellas, I just couldn't hold him! He's getting away! Hey, get back here! We're not done with you! How far do you think he can go, you melonhead? Michelle, please feed dogs first, Sunny, and Mutt. Good morning! Hey. <laughs> Big day today, huh? You can say that again. Tomorrow's gonna be even a bigger day. Uh, we still have a safe place, right? Don't worry, Michelle. We'll save the place. Yeah. Now, where's Sunny and Bruce? I have to go find them. Dodgy daycare. What a stupid name. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Doggy daycare. Doggy daycare. Wow, <laughs> that's a much better name. Because I love me some dogs. Okay. Closed is for sucker.
You're witnessing firsthand how much help animals really need. I am in shock. I can't believe we're actually saving them. And all the bad things that happens behind the scenes. Lucky for them, the doggy daycare champions were on the case. Anything you want to say? Sir, unlicensed dog breeding kennels like these are all over the country. They cage and they breed dogs and they sell them to different pet shops. So if you're interested in getting a dog, I suggest that you go to a shelter or maybe a pound because a lot of the stores are getting their dogs from places like these and we aren't even aware of it. Oh, ah, it's so cute! So small! <laughs> Where's the champion of today? Thanks to this guy, he saved today. Shaq's Amelia, it was nothing. This is for you and mom, dad. I'm so glad we were able to save you from that kidnapper, Sarah. Thanks for rescuing me. You're so pretty. Thank you. Gosh, what do we do? Oh, fine, I'll go.
I love spending time with you, Sarah. Me too. Oh, I don't know what to say. I would love to grow old with you, Sarah. You look just as beautiful today as the day we met. Oh, you're just as romantic. I didn't know you were rich. Yep. This is my place. I love Michelle and Amelia. They take such great care of us. So do I. <laughs> You're so cute. Wags and Whiskers takes care of a lot of dogs, just like me. But since Michelle's parents died, they've had a hard time financially. Oh, I'd hate to lose my home. Do you think your people could help? Okay, whatever you say. Oh, that would be terrific. I can't wait to tell Michelle. Sarah is so pretty and such soft fur. And she said her people could help the doggy daycare. Ha ha! a boy, Mutt! Oh, sounds like you got a bad essay. Wunderbar, Mutt. Congratulations. We are so happy for you. Thanks, fellas. Sarah is terrific. And I just hope that her people can help the doggy daycare. Yeah, well, if you hear anything, give give us give us a call. Perfect. Huh? This is a new dog for the doggy daycare. She looks a bit nervous. I was reading about unlicensed dog kennels, and they said that pet shops are the biggest buyers yet. I bet most of them don't even know where their dogs are coming from. There needs to be a lot more awareness of that problem. I agree. Okay, yeah, no, we need to strike while the iron's hot. Okay. Awesome. So uh, this is the plan, ladies. I'm gonna get you guys telling us a bunch of funny stories, some heartwarming stories about the dogs, and then I'm gonna set up a bunch of cameras around the yards just to get a bunch of footage of you, you know, running around and playing. You're gonna film the dogs? Yeah. Oh well, yeah, that's right, Miss Bright. Of course I'm gonna film the dogs. You know, and then later we're gonna dub some voices, a storyline over top of it. You know, give them each their own personality. It's gonna be great. I'm going to be on TV. Yes, you are, and you're going to shine beautiful. Mm -hmm. Are you having fun? Yeah. It's a really nice day. Why don't you guys go outside and have some fun? Okay. Doggy daycare is going to be so famous. We'll see. Do you think people would like to see doggy theater or doggy stand up comedy? Huh. Maybe a doggy dancer. Not to worry, girls. I've got this all handled. You see, I'm a triple threat. I can sing, dance, and look good. Champ, you are so full of kibble. Of course, the only dog who should be on the television should be me. Just listen to my adorable accent. Ah, you guys are both a couple of melon heads. Why would I want to see your mugs on the television? Look at me. I should be there. I got class. Perfect. So, you know, just naturally, just, just tell me a story. Well, about a year ago. I think I pooped my pants. Oops. 
Woo! No more wet food. <laughs> Look on Bruce's face. I swear it looked like he was trying to cover the pot with something. Sunny is very protective of her family. There was this one time. That is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Wow. How about you head home? No. To the dumpster. Oh, great name! <laughs> Where'd you come up with that? Your little friends with the dogs, did they tell you it? <laughs> did you see her? Yeah. <laughs> hey, you guys should be nicer. What if somebody teased you? You wouldn't like it much now, would ya? You are so pathetic, useless, and lonely. You should just leave. And you kind of deserve Do you have it. brothers? Do you have sisters? Yeah. Do you have yes. people who respect you? Yes. Because yeah. the way you're talking to Wait. me is garbage. On the street. Yeah. Not worse. How about you go back to your home slash alley and hang out with the other garbage? Yeah. Let's try and find I have some. a family that respects me. Listen up, everybody. Right here, right now, one time only, it's the Dumpster family with their little dog friends. We're still called friends. Yeah. Why don't you just scram and go back to the dumpster? Yeah. I'll see you later, like when loser. I take out the trash. You know what? Just bye, loser. Bye. bye. See ya. Have fun. I don't. In the trash. You tell me you're a bully. It's all good meals. It was a long time ago. Mm -hmm. I haven't said mean words since then. Okay, ladies, I think we got enough for today. The dog catcher. I'm gonna get you up. It's the last time you. What are you doing to the? Oh, man, you are a boil on the backside of your man. Help! Help. Somebody get him I'm away from me. Through. I'm coming through. Oh, you. Ah. Ah. Oh, please let me go. Run, guys. It's the dog catcher again. I can't let him catch me. Gotta hide. You come back. Come. You come back here. No, 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 no. He'll never find me here. Oh, there's Michelle's puffer. She needs this. I'm coming, Michelle. I've got your medicine. That was amazing. Hey, I'm gonna upload this to YouTube. Maybe it'll help save the daycare. Matt, you're a hero, is it? I'm not a hero. I was just trying to get away from that bad dog catcher, and I saw Michelle's puffer, and I knew she needed it. Did you save the day? You saved the day, <laughs> bud. Chris, I've got some bad news for you. What bad news? You got a phone call. This is the third time this has happened. Yeah. Yeah, I, I almost got that dog. Yelling, bro. Chris, I, 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 I'm not... I, I, no, Chris, I'm sorry, I can't do it. It's, it's that brown dog. Chris, I don't care who it is, it's the third time. You're done. You're finished in this business. No, dog catching's all I've ever known. I, I'm... Boss, I'm a dog catcher. Don't worry about the dog, Chris. you got to worry about yourself. i got to worry about myself. I can't jeopardize the business. What am I going to do? Well, you know what, Chris? You're going to have to find another profession. That's it. I'm sorry. You're fired, and I've had it. Okay? Just come get your paycheck, and that's it. Hey, what are you doing on this private property? 
Like, do you understand that this is private property? You can't be here. I just lost my job. So you you're catching dogs. Like, like these, job. these dogs don't need to be caught. This is supposed to be a safe place for dogs. I've been a dog catcher all my <laughs> life. I don't want to be caught by that dog catcher. Next time, I'm going to make sure I can get under this fence. Let me see. I just, if I can just squeeze under, like. Get, ah. These dogs are here because this dogs is dogs all my life. What is going on here? I, I lost my job. I can't catch dogs anymore. I'm stuck. Help me. Well, you know, you wouldn't be too bad around here. Listen, you lost your job. Instead of being a dog catcher, do you want to help us out? We have a dog to daycare. here. I can stay with dogs. I can work with dogs again. Oh, it hurts. I can't breathe. What about tomorrow at nine? Oh, my God. Thanks. This is great. I'm in. Someone help me. All right. Bye. Help. Oh, it hurts. Oh, it so hurts. Oh. He's hurt. I don't want to hurt him. Bring him over here. Okay? Oh, baby. My chest hurts. Careful. What happened? Is everything okay? Let's see. Okay, boy. Have him come soon. Dr. Levy! Help! Let's hurt! Dr. Levy? Oh no, much. Let me see. He's gonna need surgery. Could be broken ribs. Relax, buddy. He's going to die because of me? No, it's not gonna happen. Dr. Levy, please do anything you can, okay? I'll do my best. Just relax, buddy. Am I dying, Dr. Levy? You'll be okay, boy. Don't you worry. I'll fix you up. I promise. You promise? After what happened to our buddy Matt, it got me thinking about Bones and his gang. No dog should ever have to be alone. They should have people to look after them. Is anybody else coming? Brucey, did you tell the rest of them? Of course I told everyone, Sonny. You told me to go and tell everybody to come to this meeting, and I told them. Well, at least I think I did. We should go have a talk with this Bones character and his guy. They deserve a second chance, yo. It's settled then. A small group of us will go off and visit Bones and his gang. We've got company coming, boys. Look sharp. It's the doggy daycare crew. Hey, Bones, don't know if you heard, but Mutt got hurt. What does that got to do with me? Why should I care about Mutt? Or any of the rest of you, for that matter? What's this really about, Sonny? It got us thinking, Bone. What if something were to happen to one of you guys? There's nobody here to look after you. Yeah, Mutt was very fortunate. But what if one of the little ones here got into an accident? And now I'm supposed to just up and place my trust in humans again? I don't think so. We look after our own up here. But wait a minute, Bon. You must- That's Amelia calling us for dinner! Go on, guys. I'll be along momentarily. Look, Bones. You know my story. Now I'm loved and cared for. You want in on some of this action? You know where to find me. Let me think about it. It's been a long time. Friend Mud is one crazy pup. Wait till people see this. People are never gonna believe this.
I'm just glad Mutt's gonna be okay. He's a tough kid. You think so, Sonny? Hmm. Well, yeah, I guess I could... He is kind of short. Hmm. Kind of like holding up a mirror. Sarah! Hey, Sarah! Over here! Hi, Sarah! What? <laughs> oh, okay. We're playing it cool. <laughs> We heard all about what is happening with you and your dogs and everything you do here. We think it's just amazing and we're truly grateful you saved our Sarah. Yeah, without much, you know, where would I be? My knight in shining armor. <sighs> we don't know what we would have done without her. My poor wife, she was so miserable when she was missing. We couldn't sleep, couldn't eat. The weirdest and horrible thoughts were running through my mind. Well, I'm sure you love your dog just like how we love all of our dogs. They're truly something special. Definitely. What we're here to talk about, though, is helping you out with your financial problems. It's the least we can do, seeing as you saved our girl. I don't know what to say. I'm in shock. We're truly grateful for the bottom of our hearts. How are you feeling, Mutt? Let me show you. How's that, Bruce? I'm telling you, Sonny, you don't look it, but that kid's tough. He wore me out. Oh, uh, you're just weak, you melon head. Yes, it is. That's wonderful news. Hey, Brucey. I think this could be it. Okay. Thank you. Talk to you soon. Have a great day. Well, sit down. Let's go for a walk. How you doing back then? How are you? How are you? <laughs> nice guy. Doggy daycare saved the day. Yeah, doggy daycare is the yeah. best. You know? they, they saved all her animals. Yeah. So, look at the dog. Oh, so yeah, yeah. Another ice cream. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, what a nice one. I'm so happy they saved the day. They did save the day. They did save the day. That's good. That, that's all awesome. happening. I don't understand. Um, they're not here. They said they're going to be here, and they get our hopes up. And hey, all. Oh, oh hi. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, you okay. weren't stressing, are you? No, no, not at all. How are you all today? <laughs> We're good. Thanks for asking yourselves. Very good. Very good. I see Matt and Sarah are getting along smashingly. We're in love. <laughs> yes. Oh, young love. How grand it is. <laughs> Of course you can. Kibble ain't cheap. Nonsense, my dear. Don't even bother arguing about it. We've made up our minds, and we can't think of anything better to spend our money on. Hey, Sonny! 
I've never seen this many numbers. Yes! <laughs> this is amazing. I, I don't know. I, I want to give you a hug. I've got dogs go. everywhere. <laughs> That's not all. We're going to be opening doggy daycares right around the state and the country. No way. No. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! <laughs> and quiet from all these melon heads. See any treats around here? I am so hungry. Oh, gee. (laughs) 